Let's see. Let's do prop a shot. Let's look at the scoreboard. Now we need extra credit for right. Gronk. Participation trophies, Gronk. whatever. Gronk, you had another good night. You went two for three, but Kay went a perfect three for three again. So she's up 15 to 10 on the season so far. Um, so Gronk, we're going to try to close this gap. You already took the Hawk to a girl off the board. So we're going to start with AJ Brown. His line for receiving is at 81 and a half yards. Does he go over or under tomorrow night? Is? Hold on. That's, yeah. who, that's who that goes. That's I really well too. I didn't yeah. know. Okay, now I get know. Up, get get great, up on your pop culture. God, okay. that is a great yeah. freaking yes. I hate yeah. myself. That is such a good guess. He's 100% right. Yeah. You were wondering in your mind, in your mind like, who's Haley Welch? Well, that's who Haley Welch is, you know? Yes, I'm a proper guy, so I don't go around saying no, those. No, I just, you know, that's a great you know, guess. Those crazy terms, you know, that uh, of her nickname. But, uh, so, oh, okay, back yeah. to the proper shot, okay? All right, we're getting off track here. I'm going with A.J. Brown to have over 81 and a half receiving yards. And he's going to do it on one play, almost one play. He's going to take a big one to the house. All right, Kay, your turn. Terry McLaurin's line for receiving yards is 59 and a half. He just hyped up that Eagles secondary. Does he go over or under that? I like the new look Eagles secondary. I like Mr. Fangio. I gave him love, but Terry is going to do his thing. This is a low line. This is giving the too much respect to the Eagles, in my opinion. He's third in the league in receiving. He's got Jaden. I know it's a short week. It's always weebly wobbly. But this he's done he's gone over this line, by the way, five times straight. Five straight games against Philly. It's gonna happen again. All right, Grok, speaking of Jaden, his line for passing touchdowns is one and a half for this game. Does he go over or under that? Oh man, I'm gonna go mm, one and a half passing touchdowns. I mean, he's not really known for all of his touchdowns. He's known for his completion percentage and all that and be able to run the ball for a touchdown as well. But if he's going to throw, throw over one and a half, I think he is. It's time that he has a breakout game throwing touchdowns as well. He has before, but he's going to have a true one. He's going to at least have two. Let's go, Jaden. I'm cheering for you, buddy. Let's go. All right, Kay. Saquon's line for rushing yards is 92 and a half on a short week. Does he go over or under that? I'm going to say over. Over. Commander's defense, they're, they're improved, but they're bottom five against every metric against the run. Like, literally the worst against the run. So, um, I feel like Saquon, he, he's fresh. He had a nice light load on Sunday. They blew out the Cowboys, so he didn't have to do much. So, he's going to be fresher, and he's going to bang the over on this. All right, let's take a look here. Let's take a look all at right, mine versus right. yours. Oh, we have one more. Oh, go. Wait, Wait, I didn't give you Eagles any time touchdown. Yeah. I mean, come on, Kay. Come on. <laughs> go for it. Okay, All right, got? I got Hamilton. I got Eagles anytime touchdown. Is that correct? Yes, you do. All right. Well, I'm going to go with the one with the best odds, obviously, so, uh, with Saquon Barkley. I mean, Saquon Barkley. I mean, he's been on fire this year. I don't know why the Giants let him go. That's still a front office mistake for the Giants. But the Eagles got him, and they're taking advantage of having him as well for kind of a great deal on, on that contract that he has. So, uh, Saquon Barkley gonna score anytime touchdown let's go i need to go three for three finally please please <laughs> plus an extra for hawk two overall go ahead yeah all right okay your anytime touchdown score for the commanders i'm gonna go right back to scary terry okay plus 160 i like that uh a lot of trash talk about how we can't keep this going against the eagles so he's gonna he's gonna absolutely bank a TD on Thursday night football. So to recap, Terry McLaurin over the receiving yards, uh, Saquon Barkley over 92 and a half rush, and Terry McLaurin, anytime touchdown, I'm doubling down on him. Gronk, what'd you go with? Yeah, so I got A.J. Brown over 81 and a half receiving yards, and then I got Jaden Daniels passing for over one and a half touchdowns, and then I got Saquon Barkley to score an anytime Touchdown, baby. Three for three. Please, football gods, I need it. FanDuel offering all customers a 30% profit boost token to use on any live wager for Thursday night's Commanders Eagles game. Please go to FanDuel Sportsbook. Take a look at some of those props. There's over 500 of them. Rob, just, uh, Rob and I just talked through those. Um, who do you like? You can even mix them up. The only thing that you need for this is they have to be minus 200 odds or longer for this Thursday night NFC East football game. More Gronk.